bro, I had like that impact. Somebody like the chat, like man, they wanna. I'm noticing like everything. Like honestly, I kind of sold the boy this shit. I started putting on the drip. I started showing niggas how to influence on Instagram. But honestly, like I feel like it was a team effort because it wasn't just me. It was you. It was Asia. It was everything. You feel me? This one here, hopefully medium as well. Yeah. I want this too. Oh my God, that's such a nice one over there. Can't go through with the bag. I want this too. I like this song. Cause I never understand these songs. I never listen for the lyrics though. I listen for the vibe. Don't live far from the pounds. Yeah, I used to hang out a lot at the pounds before. We in the VIP room in Burberry just because they know your boy spinning that guap, you know what I'm saying? So they giving us the big champagne, big water, big Coca-Cola, ATL, you know what's going down. Shit everywhere, you feel me? ATL everywhere, Aristotle on the bed, they grip the globe, Coca-Cola, you feel me? We everywhere. Like. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We ain't playing with them. Okay, let's see. Not You say you're gonna do business with a nigga, do business with a nigga, play your position. Everybody can't be top dog, but what you can do is put yourself in position to be top dog, if that makes sense. But you ain't gotta do no whole shit, you ain't gotta snake nobody to be top dog for real. You really don't. You don't have to do that, you know what I'm saying? That's what's gonna make you a man, that's what's gonna put you above everybody. Cause once you, once you done snake somebody to get to where you at, there's gonna be people after you. And you gonna be hunting, you can't sleep at night, you know what I mean? See, I be humble about this shit though, because real shit though, anybody can get it in this world. So it's like at a certain, no matter what, you can pop your shit, but you gotta be a certain level of humble because anybody can get got. You gotta kinda pop your shit in the give back way to keep yourself out the way. You know what I mean? Because if you all in the way, I'm the biggest, I'm the this, but you know you not that and you got some shit that could be exposed, they gonna dig deep and try to find that. You feel me? So when I say I'm this, I gotta mean it. If I say I got the best course, I gotta mean it. Cause somebody gonna take that course. Yeah. And say, and then when they take my course, they like, all right, buddy got the best option training course for real. He really does know what he's talking about. He doing a Sunday watch list and calling the players out live, then showing the money he made from it. Do you wanna sell to people one time or forever? You get what I'm saying? Like, that's why I don't scam. What I realize is, I want niggas to buy for me forever. Thank you. I want people to fuck with me forever. White people, black people, I don't care. We fuck with every burger. Show you what this ain't that. Two K in the white band, man. Two K in the white band. I just watched the Kanye interview. He said the reason why I'm getting lit and famous is because after a while I won't have to spend my money no more. 
went to the club, drew goddamn about 4,000 ones. And then my arm, my arm was hurting. I almost caught a cramp in my arm, for real. Don't do too many ones. That what happened last night. You feel me? Now we smoking on the real one, not the two. You said who wants to take a jerry all the nigga watching? It's a custom court built specifically to my shot. It's an NBA level court. It's regular court. I ain't trying to hit it. They always say that. You give me balls since I'm at home? Yeah. All right. Come on, man. I got one eye. Get off me. Backboard. Now you're on my level. It's a block. Okay. That's the shot. He loves taking that close shot, huh? Close shot 99? <laughs> Give me a ball, boy. Uh -huh, no more close shots. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Ah, it's crazy because I really can't even see. Uh -huh. We only play one shot. Shoot over you. Are you dribbling back there? You ain't gonna do nothing. You solid? Come on now. Uh-oh. Yeah, now. Back on this nigga. One out. One out. Ah, air ball. Who you up with? Hold my jury. It's damn. I gotta take this off. He complaining now. That shit fucking up my layup. No, I'm fucking up your layup. You ain't rocking that. Quit playing with me, boy. Easy. Open shot in his face. You know you can't shoot. I get you. This fool hit my bad ass. Hey, he reached our team, man. I had to. He just had to do this. That point don't count. You can't foul a hack. You can't foul what? a hack, man. Shoot for it, die. You even felt it, then you kept running. And you knew it was my bad eye. All right. Three up. There we go. Come on, boy. Two smokers play basketball. Yeah, exactly. Woo! Got him. Quit playing with me, bro. You waste so much energy on those.
best move of the night. Bap, right in my back. Oh, then I crossed him. So hard no, then I crossed him. Hey, hey. So he tried to reach, right? He was like, Leon was out there. Leon to tell you the truth. And then I did that. Then then drove to the hole. Oh, he was like, oh, you hit me. When he did this. He did this on that purpose, so he looked so at me and said, this, I you reach our teeth. That's what he said. Uh, said. He said, you reach our teeth. Pop, pop me in the eye. You reach our teeth. And I'm standing like this. Like, I'm like, drove on him so many times. Cool. And then he fouled so many times. That's me. I always overthink the future. Yeah. I try to always plan, like, what yeah, is going on? Yeah. Five years after you, I always say that stuff. Always. What am I going to do five years Yeah, because, like, like, you don't never know. If you're one stream of income, it's or gone. if you'll fall out of love with yeah. it, you always want a backup plan, or you want to bring in some money doing something different. I seen a post about that. It said, we're never happy with our successes because we're not living in the present, we're living in the future. Exactly. Trying to figure out if we're going to be able to maintain what we got. But yeah. those same minded people, they always good in the future. They already plan for it, you know? Right. They're not just sitting back like, oh, I'm good. It's like a lot of times, we get too hungry and itching for more and more and more. And then sometimes you just gotta just sit in the present, yeah. realize who you are, and kind of like decompress. Like don't watch anything, don't watch anybody. Just be focused on you, your family, and your business. Like you really gotta get into that mode or you gonna get sucked into trying to want more all the time. Trying to want more all the time. And really, you should be really focused on bettering your what you got going on, you feel me, around you. I learned like not to let other people or or how others think dictate how I move. So it's like, I'm gonna smoke weed, I'm gonna be myself because you gonna find out eventually. I want you to understand that this is about making money. Yeah. So I kind of built a culture of, you can be exactly you. Mm -hmm. You don't gotta pretend to be anybody else. You can wear whatever you wanna wear and you can be respected as someone in the financial literacy space. And I really made people feel comfortable, like the weed smokers, the whoever you are, because we all do that under the table. But it's like, I'm the one doing it, putting it right in y'all face, and teaching you financial literacy, and putting on that drip, you feel me? Showing you family. Uh, and then showing a the young man like black excellence, and then having a black wife, stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like that's important, you know, me yeah. personally, you feel me? That's everything I built too. My fans see me, they see the jewelry, the tattoos, the hair, it reminds you of thug, gangbanger, rapper. But like you said, we get money, we in the financial literal space, we know how to talk and move different, we can go in any room, intellect with anybody, but we got the, the accessories of this low life. Which is crazy because we teaching kids you can be smart and look cool at the same time without doing anything illegal. Yeah. I make YouTube videos, family content, and I can afford a million dollar jewelry, yeah. my closet, millions of dollars, the cars, the rappers got all this stuff. It's and crazy. consistency, the power of consistency. Like, oh yeah. I put in three years worth of work of my business. So it's like, I done made so many connections. I done did so many experiences. I know how to run ads. I know how to do all that. Like I knew how to, I just pretty much figured out a system to like keep growing and like keep my money coming in.